Okay, welcome back to Northern Ants Gaming. We are back in American Truck Simulator. Uh, after the last delivery, we had delivered to Fort Collins, and we were extremely tired. So what I did is I found myself a truck stop uh, off camera and slept the night. And then I slept a little longer because it was still only 4 o'clock, so I wanted to get back to the daytime. So now what we're doing is we are going to pick Fort Collins, and we're going to see if we can find a good uh, cargo to carry. Uh, I don't want it to be too long of a route, but let's uh, find something that looks cool. And it could be a little bit longer route. Uh, let's see. I don't. I've never really driven a dual trailer before. Let's see, Fort Collins to Colorado Springs. Let's see, what town is this little one in the middle here? Oh, Denver. Well, I guess it's not little. <laughs> let's uh, let's see if we can find something to Denver, because I want to kind of hop, skip, and jump from one town to the next. There we go. Here's a Denver. It's, uh, it doesn't say how far it is, but it's going to be, so it looks like some pipe. That'll be pretty cool. Let's, uh, pick that. So Fort, Fort Collins to Denver, Colorado today. And I'm going to play straight through. I'm not going to make it into two parts. It might be a little bit longer. Um, but instead of dividing it up, that I can get more deliveries in if we do these short jumps. And then eventually, when I start finishing up with the with the areas, then we'll start doing some longer routes and stuff. Maybe do a live stream or something like that. I'm, I've am i been researching steering wheels and kind of pricing them and stuff. And really starting to consider getting one, which would be would make it a whole lot nicer to have the actual steering wheel. I'm looking at like the 920, the G920, a Logitech, or what was the other one, a 29, G29 or something like that. They look pretty good. The price is a little bit more than I was, you know, hoping, but, you know, it'll improve the quality of the video if I'm not using a controller more realistic. And eventually I want to get that a VR or where you put it on and it tracks where you're looking on the screen too it would really be cool okay well let's oh no shoot um well I just slept again okay now I can't rest anymore <laughs> oh no I pushed the wrong button well I just took us to 1 a.m. and it's raining that'll make it interesting Okay, let's see, what's the... What button? There's the wipers. Okay. And... Oh, okay, there we go. Well, I guess we're driving in the dark and in the rain. Oh, EP why I slept longer so I wouldn't have to plus my delivery is probably going to be pretty close to being expired so we'll see once we get up there to pick this up Got an extra little light on in my. I don't know if is that. Oh, okay, that was. Uh, I had hit V. I love the rain effects on the window. It looks so realistic. It's really cool. Wait a minute. Why do they have? Oh, it's one way kind of thing so the steering wheel is going to make this so much easier to to drive because my 
this controller that I'm using is pretty old, so it's starting to stick. Sticking's not a good thing when you're going around a corner and all of a sudden you keep going around a corner even though you're wanted to stop going around it. Yike. The thing I love too on these side windows as you're going fast, it does the, the rain does that streaking. Like it'll it'll start moving with the wind. truck has got its hazard lights on. Okay, we should be coming up on it here pretty quick. We'll see if the trailer is still available or if it's a uh, a chance that it might be uh, gonna be late because I had to hit that sleep button. Here's our trailer right here. Oh cool, I got a guy standing out there. Probably going, where, the, where have you been? So you're late. Take a look. Uh, here's our map. Uh, distance, 82 miles. Trip time, 1 hour, 34 minutes. Okay, that's not going to be very far. Uh, can't get out that way, can we? got to go this way. It's it's weird not using uh, the GPS, the big GPS, because it gives me so much more information than the small one does. plus side of driving at this time is not much in the way of traffic. Might be more once we get into Denver though. I've got my high beams on. I don't know how to turn them off. Hopefully it, it's not like a, an actual like, irritant. And the recruiting office, I must have all that when I already drove past coming into town. So it's already seen. that green. Nice. Boy, I'm hitting the green lights. Or yellow. After I noticed last time I played when it rained, is uh, after the rain stopped, the water gradually dried off. Oh shoot, that's where I want to turn. So, boy. 
way. <laughs> Managed to stop in time, Mary. <laughs> it's close. <laughs> I was so busy watching the raindrops on the side window. Still yellow. Rain does make the night a little bit cooler. We're driving. I know there's trains. I haven't come across one since I started playing again. Which I hope I don't jinx myself on that because sometimes I can take a while for them to get by. Getting all the green lights until I said something. Let's see, what highway are we getting on here? Oh. Like Junction twenty five, right hand lane. right over here. Twenty-five south to Denver. Oh, we gotta stop at the wayside. Gotta get our trailer weighed. I've been fortunate with these too lately. Okay. 81,570 pounds. Boy, a lot of traffic for time of morning. Let me over. Five right now. Boy, I must. Boy, it's raining. Yeah, the clouds definitely uh, limiting the visibility. That's for sure. No stars out tonight. Fortunately, can't see the rain on the side window right now either, though. Kind of cool looking, and I love how. It, it's just it's so realistic it's so cool that's why it's gonna be really cool if I get the steering wheel it'll make the immersion so much better and then the steering wheel will be doing that jerky thing too because I have to, to auto like to correct I have to like tap the controller to, to 
straighten myself out. Oh, speed limit's 65 now. Now as you watch the rain that's already on the window, there's still the droplets, but it'll gradually dry. It's so funny, I've been playing these games for years and years and years, but I still think back on, you know, like the Atari, you know, first gaming system that I had when I was a kid. And to see games that, like, so, so realistic like this, it just still blows my mind, even though I play them every day. Still that generation where we, you know, we didn't have cell phones, we didn't have, you know, I think I had a pager. <laughs> that was my first thing when I was in, out of high school, actually. Ooh, gonna slow down. <laughs> Sharp corner. Yeah, it's a pretty. I thought I heard. Oh, that is a train. It sounded like it. Yep, right above, in front of us. At least I don't have to go that way. My delivery is right here. top of the thing for it to open. Could probably run into it. Last time I ran into an invisible barrier like that was uh, there was a, a bridge that was going across it and I didn't realize it was had a gate up because the bridge was up for to let a ship through. <laughs> yeah, and I was going full speed. <laughs> Yeah, it wasn't good. <laughs> oh, so... See over this way? Okay, yeah, there's the X on the ground right there. Okay, let's, uh... uh let's see, how do we... This delivery... Yeah, let's deliver it. Get some XP. Get some more... Oh, if we can get through here. Oh, 
Oh man. You know what? I'm just, I'm just gonna go this way. Oh, come on. Yeah, <laughs> I guess. Caught the curve a little bit there. Okay, where do I gotta go? That's not too bad. It, well, I've given us the option to skip the delivery, but as I'm pulling into the spot... <laughs> Okay. Another successful delivery. Cool. And we got to drive a little in the rain and some a little dark, which was not my intent. <laughs> but oh well, it turned out pretty good. It wasn't a real long run, so it didn't take too long. Uh, we did driven 88 miles. Took time taken, 20 minutes. 13 gallons used. Nice. I've had 95 deliveries made through uh, the world of trucks. Okay. There's my truck again that I've been using. I could still go and get some more drivers and stuff like that. I might do that off camera. If if you want to see me do that, you know, try hiring people and getting more trucks and stuff like that. Which might be fun. Um, let me know in the comments if that's something you want to see. Me picking out trucks and assigning new drivers and uh, and things like kind of managing my business a little bit. We might might dedicate a, an episode to doing something like that once I get some more money saved up. I've got 158700 right now. Uh, might be enough to buy a basic truck. Um, and we can get trailers and things like that too. If Any of those things if you're interested in seeing me do. Uh, let me know down in the comments. Remember to hit that like button on the video. If you're not subscribed yet, please make sure you do that right now. Help me get up to that thousand. I've been working real hard to get to it for my subscriber count. So thank you so much for watching and I appreciate it. You have a great rest of your day. Don't forget to check out the Northern Ants merch shop. The link is in most of the descriptions of the videos plus on my homepage. <music>